16-year-old Keely Williams has overcome some heartbreaking hurdles in her life, in her very young life, I should say. The South Garland High School sophomore has already been accepted into an Ivy League school, and she hopes to attend a, a summer program at Harvard in just a, a little bit. But Fox 4's Sean Rabb reports Keely has one more obstacle to overcome before she can do that. I thought we were doing a whole science fair project. Keely Williams is a good student at South Garland High School, but it's how teachers talk about her that gets your attention. I told my wife I wish I could adopt the kid, bring her home, because she is, um, for everything that she's been through, she keeps a smile on her face. <laughs> Despite her smile, Keely knows the pain of separation, first from her mother. When I was 10 years old, um, in the fifth grade, she died from um, cancer that spread throughout her whole body. Then, her siblings scattered among relatives. Ever since then, me and my brothers and sisters have been moving around from place to place. Keely concentrated on school. And then you just keep asking these questions, and then you keep finding your answers. And, and has already been accepted in Harvard. GPA is 3.8. She is in five honors classes. The sky is the limit for that girl. She is amazing. Williams, who wants to be a forensic pathologist, accepted to Harvard's secondary summer school program, one of 1,000 nationwide. Its cost, $10,000. Uh, we were looking for ways to raise money. I've always been pretty good about seeking donations from community members. Natalie Barkemper led the campaign to help Keeley's Harvard hopes become a reality, reaching out to Garland's business community, much of that fundraising through social media. We tweeted everyone we could think of, Harvard alumni, anyone that we thought could maybe understand the importance of an opportunity like this. Because the paper is due next Thursday. So I need World to history teacher David Yates, one of those who understood, and one of the many teachers who donated hundreds of dollars to help Keeley. She's a great student. She deserves every opportunity that's presented to her, and so I wanted to make sure that that happened for her. I need you to be your own creator. Keeley doesn't yet have all the money she needs to pay for the Harvard program, but she's holding on to hope and her mother's love. But I know that she would have wanted me to do something with my life, so I'm going to try my hardest to do it. All right, Sean Rabb's in studio to talk more about Keely and, what, and what's going to happen for her. Let's, let's first talk about how odd, it, not odd, there are good kids, but they don't always make TV. Right. You know, and to hear a teacher say, I want to adopt her, and I know these teachers who are, have limited funds themselves are donating to this. It's Out of their own pocket. Like, That's what really got our attention. Teachers saying, I wish we could adopt her and take her home. Others uh, sacrificing hundreds of dollars of their own monies to try to make this happen for her. No, she's got challenges. Who does she stay with now? Who does she live with? She lives with her grandmother. Okay. Uh, and her grandmother is the one who actually went on the Internet, uh, got all the information about applying to Harvard, and encouraged her to do so. Well, she said she'd take out a loan if she had to to make this happen. You yeah. think it's, it's got a chance, and there's, there's a way to get in contact with right. Holland, right, and help if people at home are touched by, by this? Sure. If anyone would like to help Keeley, you can do so by contacting the South Garland High School. She has to pay those fees to Harvard no later than Monday, May 20th, and, of course, we'll let you know One week. she makes it. Right. One week from today. All right. Good to meet her. Good to meet Keeley. Thanks, Sean. All right.